Hi, class 4 and 5, back again. Uh, let's begin with uh, our formulas, what are there to, uh, for this term. Let's see, okay, first of all, this is the book you all are having, 7a, you know the process how we do it, 7b is also with you, but 7b you will do as your home assignment, okay. As soon as you complete one page here, you will complete there also one page, simultaneously it should go, okay. Now, let me tell you one thing. In this book, see, for practicing of formulas, it's already given to you, this page, page number 4. I hope you all can see this. Page number 4, you will see small friend formula. Once place you will write, tens place you will write, two times you will do. That means, you will copy this. After that, you will do plus 10, plus 20, plus 30, plus 40. Same again, repeat. Then, small friend formula. This also same thing, small friend formula plus and then here minus. So same thing you are going to copy, okay. And uh, for tens place you will do 50s part, plus 10 minus 10 plus 20 minus 20 plus 30 minus 30 plus 40 minus 40. Done. After that you will move to your big friend formula, okay. What we have done in big friend, plus is there, minus is there, both. From 1 to 9, 1 to 9. Again from 10 to 90, 10 to 90, minus plus both. Done. This page, after getting my video, this should be completed immediate, immediately. After that, you will do this page. Now keep in mind, remember in the last year class also I told you, orals you are not going to do. This is for me. So when we meet, I will give you questions. So you are not going to touch this. No one will touch this line. Okay, this full subtraction addition with scale. So you have to use scale. Formulas can be small friend, can be big friend. Use and solve it. Then this also same uh, using your scale. Formulas can be small, big, anything. Here visualization. So absolute visualization you have to follow and you have to do. Okay, and then now comes introduction to combination formulas or it is called complement mixed complement this page page number eight now focus to what i say okay class four and five please focus to what i say abacus four and five now see here small friend we had uh, best friend one two three four and we had common friend 5. Hmm? In small friend. Common friend is 5. In big friend, we have from 1 to 9. Even the best friends also 1 to 9. And common friend is 10. Done. Now, suppose in your scale or when you visualize. Say, uh, you are unable to do directly. So you use, first you apply small friend. Hmm? Then suppose you see, small friend is also not possible. So what you do, you apply big friend. Till this much we know it. It is clear to us. But when you see a sum where you are unable to apply small friend, even big friend, then what is the process? How am I going to solve the sum in abacus? How we will do there is a process. This process is called combination formula. Combination formula. Clear? Now what is combination formula? First, see, use your brain and think properly. In combination formula, we are not using one, two, three, four, five. Because one is having formula of small friend. Two also small friend. Three also small friend. Four also small friend. Right? Now, small friend means four, three, two, one. Okay? After four, three, two, one, we don't have any formula. We cannot divide four, three, two, one. Right? So it's not possible for 1, 2, 3, 4. What is possible is with 9, 8, 
7 and 6. In combination also we will have plus formula, minus formula. Till this much clear? I hope you have understood. So to use small friend, big friend together we are using this combination formula. Okay. Now what is the pattern of it? See here. When my scale uh, gives me this answer that the, uh, the question which I am trying to solve is not possible directly, not possible with small, not possible with big. Then I have to use some other formula. That is called combination. And combination of what? Small friend, big friend. Simple. So I know small friend formula. I know big friend formula. When I am implementing these two formulas in my scale or visualizing it, then only I am able to do combination formula. That is the main thing. Now for combination formula, we have plus 9, plus 8, plus 7, plus 6. After this, nothing is there. That you all can say why it is not there. Because plus 5 means 5 is already a common friend. It is not having any division. Okay. Then 4. 4 also we cannot have any division. 3 also we can't have any division. 2 also, 1 also we cannot have any division. We can have division only in this. Four steps. Why? Because what is the formula of plus 9 in big friend? It says minus 1 plus 10. Right? Now if it is minus 1 plus 10, that means we know minus 1 is having another formula. What is that formula? I think somebody is guessing from there. Right? It is, yes you you are correct. Minus 1 means, what is the formula? Plus 4 minus 5. Done. And don't forget to add plus 10. This is your complete formula of combination. By chance, you, you did this in the scale. And you forgot this. That means you did only the half part. Okay. So keep in mind that when you are doing combination... If you need to apply combination in your sum, then you have to keep in mind that last part is 10. So I will do this. First I will complete this. Then I will do this. First 1's place, then 10's place. Understood? I will explain once again. When I will do with plus 8, what is the formula in big friend first? Focus on big friend immediately. Minus 2 plus 10. Fine. Minus 2 plus 10. Okay. But minus 2 is also having another formula. Right? In small friend. What is that formula? It is plus 3 minus 5. Then don't forget to add this plus 10. This is combination formula. When you apply this full numbers together, then only you are able to solve that sum. Clear? Suppose you are doing plus 7. Plus 7 formula says minus 3 plus 10. So minus 3 is again having a small friend formula. What is that? Plus 2 minus 5 then add plus 10. Once place done, 10's place done, my answer is done. Okay? Now plus 6 means minus 4 plus 10 in big friend. Correct? Now minus 4 is again having another formula in small friend. What is that? Ma uh, plus 1 minus 5 plus 10. Until and unless you add 10, your answer is wrong. Why I am saying this repeatedly? Because this is the mistake we are going to do. So we won't repeat this mistake for that sake only I am repeating Whenever you divide the formula, you do it in this way. And keep in mind, very simple thing. For plus, we start with plus sign. Now we start with plus sign in combination. For combination formula, plus means addition. We start with plus sign. If you remember this, it is very clear. And second point you need to remember, we start with 1's place. Then we move to 10's place. 
we don't start with tens place in combination formula we start with ones place means i will first complete my ones place i will do plus 1 minus 5 after doing that i will do plus 10 see my finger then you will understand if i want to do 6 that means i will do plus 1 minus 5 plus 10 correct if i want to do 7 then what is my formula plus 2 minus 5 Plus ten, so plus two minus five plus ten. My formula is done. Is it clear? So once again, we will repeat in combination formula. If you want, you can note down. If you want, you can write it down. In combination formula, what you see is there are four steps: plus nine, plus eight, plus seven, plus six. After that, there is no combination formula. so if i need to apply combination formula it will only start when my i have to add plus 9 or plus 90 if i have to add plus 8 or plus 80 if i have to add plus 7 or plus 70 or else plus 6 plus 60 then only i will apply this formula second thing whenever i will apply combination formula if it is addition it will of course start with plus sign done then third thing is wait a minute third thing is whenever i will apply the formula i need to keep in mind that first i will do ones place then i will do tens place done fourth thing always keep in mind three steps you have to follow you have to add you have to minus and you have to add again add Minus add clear. For example, plus nine is equal to plus four minus five plus ten. My combination formula is done. Clear. So today till this much, we have started with combination formula addition. I have explained you how to do it. You will practice at home. Try to do till this page. By the time I will again come with the next topic. till this page page number 7 page number 6 page number 5 page number 4 is your homework you are going to do both the books level 7 a 7 b you need to complete this and then again when i come back what we will do is each page first five i will do in the scale and rest all you you are going to do it at home in this way we will solve all the pages okay so combination formula pattern i have told you addition pattern i have told you how to do it just practice it with your scale practice the fingers with your scale so that you are used to with it this time it is not only 1 and 2 this time it is 3 plus minus plus plus minus plus clear so we we'll meet again see you bye bye take care all of you okay